Hi and good afternoon. Today we've come down to the school to do a little segment that I call uh, we're going to put it to the test. And basically and today we're going to see if an old guy can remember how to ride a bike. Because it's been, I was 18 years old the last time I rode a bike. And the last time I rode a bike it was actually a tandem bicycle. And after that we went, our family went to Disney World and rode one of those Surrey bikes and they kicked me off of that bike because I wasn't pedaling good enough for them and they made me walk the rest of the way back. It was probably like a mile loop or a half mile loop and we got like halfway and they kicked me off. So uh, it's been a long time since I rode a bike but I had an uh, old relative that rode a bike in the circus many many years ago. He, uh, he rode the bike with uh, someone by the name of George uh, Aptite and uh, Larry Assel. And uh, unfortunately, their uh, careers came to a, an abrupt end. It was horrible. It was horrible. A tragic accident happened in the circus under the big top there. A lot of people were there that day. And uh, one of the monkeys got loose out of the cage and ran right in front of the bicycle. And Larry fell right over George. And it was just tragic. It ruins everybody's career. And the next day in the paper, uh, the headline says a famous bicyclist fall asshole over appetite so that's my a little bit of experience with the bike but i don't know if marion liked that story or not but i'm putting it in anyway <laughs> so anyway here we go we're just going to jump right to it and uh, we're going to see if an old guy can remember how to ride a bike now the problem is this is you want to take a shot of this lovely bike here it's a uh, girl's bike with a lovely purple basket on it and a beautiful purple shine to it. Yeah, it's it my baby. So I'm hoping it's going to be safe, and uh, we're just going to see if an old guy can remember how to ride a bike. Let's we're going to put it to the test. <laughs> so here we go. Think I can do this? I have full confidence you can do this. Just don't scratch my bike. You know, back in the day, you know, you used to go like that. You put your foot on the pedal, you'd scoot, and boom, you go. But in this particular case, since I can't throw my leg up over, just, <laughs> I haven't thrown my leg over anything in years. <laughs> so, we're just going to kind of step over on it. See, I'm starting off to the left. Well, move the... I feel a little bit like uh, Evil Knievel, probably when he was going over the Snake River Canyon. You know, a little <laughs> nervous and stuff like that. That's kind of like how I feel right now. I'm actually afraid to take off. So, you know, I think what I'm gonna just kind of scooch forward here a little bit. And Watch the pole. You know, I'm not, I'm really not feeling it. Once, okay, you, get go go Once you get going, you'll be fine. Once I get going, there we go, a little. It's, uh, it's nervous time, people. Here we go. Can an old guy, well, I'm not gonna get cocky, that's for sure. <laughs> He's doing great. Look at that balance. He's still got it. Can he turn? Or is he just going to ride off into oblivion? <laughs> okay. Well. Your horn. <laughs> well, ah. Uh. <laughs> Uh, it's going to end this segment here. I'll put it to the test. If an old guy can remember how to ride a bike, evidently he can. 
Although I didn't really find an old guy around here. I was really wanting to find an old guy to, to do it, so I had to jump on there. But uh, I hope you all enjoyed it, and uh, I plan on doing more of these. Uh, the next uh, segment of Put It to the Test is that uh, I'm going to test the old theory. If you cross your eyes long enough, will they actually stay that way? So that, that could be an exciting uh, put it to the test right there. So anyway, thanks a lot for watching. Hope you all have a great day. Take care.